What's up, folks? I'm over in ice-clad ocean, fighting with some cougars and some uh, lovely shadow guardians. It's been a lot of fun. Hang on a second here. Kill both of these off. Uh, definitely not getting bad experience here. I tend to prefer to get cougars, but sometimes I clear out the Shadow Guardians just to keep them from uh, jumping up on me. Oh my god, what a jackass cougar. I've had like no resist here this whole time. Anyways, I'm pretty used to the XP here. I've been here. Uh, most of this level. Wow! What? Really? Really? It's like it knows I hit the record button somehow. Uh, it knew I also had enough mana to kill more of his friends, so he's like trying to save him, I think. Alright, we'll do a old fashioned way. Whack him with a hammer. So, one advantage you do have, um, since these aren't friendly to one another, if you get them both down to like the 20% mark, they will just kind of uh, run off, basically. Stand here and let you beat them to death with a hammer or whatever object you choose to beat them with. Doesn't matter to me. What quality cougar skin, a bunch of garbage. I'm going to start on this, which is fine because I totally need some one-hand blunt skill anyways. Actually okay with this. Yeah, I'm still at 81 on one hand blunt, so pays off. Make sure I'm not about to get ambushed by another one of these things. Cool. And just for the sake of making this video in today, we're gonna go ahead and throw another nuke in here. Still is not enough. I need to swap that with combust, I'm afraid. I didn't take into consideration these things have more hit points than my prior targets. Yeah. It's all good though. Come on, little guy. Please die. Today. <laughs> Anyways, like I said, um, not bad experience here. The second one I killed this thing. And the second one I killed this thing. And the second one I... And it's... Really? Thank you. As you can see, the experience bar moves a pretty good bit from these. That bad of a little camp. Uh, so I usually hang out around this knoll hut. There's a couple of quests related to the various cougar skins here as well. And it's actually, this little area is a safe place to meditate, and I believe you have a vendor here as well, somewhere. Possibly. He's somewhere else, though. There is a vendor nearby. It's probably in the pirate outpost they have kind of around the corner, which I've actually not visited yet, so I'll probably do that towards the end of the video just for the heck of it. So I'm going to pause and meditate up, and then I'm going to go kill some more stuff out here. Kind of show that process. So I'm back, and I am after my next target. I believe to be one of his friends. Shit, all the spells. So I get for moving my spells around. Good. Armed. It's time to find another snow cougar. He is way the hell out here. Way the hell out here. Oh, good though. We're going to pull all of them back this way a little way. Okay. Send them up cougar after that cougar. Send them up to him. Yeah, they definitely like you when you ensnare them. Regeneration. Cool though, I'm not going to get speed this time. That's right. I'm going to execute all of these. Unfortunately, my cougar is handily winning. He's probably a little bit higher level than this cougar. I may have some 
issues there, especially if Aku keeps winning. Yeah, so I think these are around level 27 to 31. Or no. What we may have to do. Actually, use my cougar to kill multiple. Looking like it. Look at that. The other cougar all of a sudden learned how to fight a little bit. How convenient. I want to deal with the Shadow Guardian too, it looks like. We're gonna get rooted, pal. We're not. It's cool. God, why are you so fast? I just need to kill a cougar. I almost hate to use that spell. Then. Cougar. Apparently I didn't actually stop. Thought I did. Okay. Once again. Like I said, flawlessly, right? Our cougar problem slowly over the course of like a minute here, and then we will simply go charm another cougar and use him to kill the shadow guardian. It's all going to work out well, damn it! Right, so while I try to kill this thing, I'm gonna talk about loot here for a second. You get a cougar claw earrings here that uh could potentially sell for about 200 plat. Uh, you can get bloodstained fangs here that sell for a tiny bit, not a whole lot. And I've seen these ice balls. Um, next thing I would point out, and this cougar shoot me and drop nut as well. Yeah, I don't totally forgot because I'm out of your rules. Speed. One more cougar. I'm gonna pull him over there to kill the other thing. Hopefully. I think die about eight. Look at all these fizzles today too. Oh my god, to resist on the ensnare. So get there a little bit quicker at least. Landed. So we're going to flawlessly charm this cougar, send him at this guardian. Let's run this guardian around a little bit of a circle here. Thankfully the cougar can actually catch him, so it should pull aggro soon. Cool deal. So now we just need some... And it looks like Cougar is in. Not. Okay, who's that? Yeah. Be a higher level chef guardian. Anyways, yeah, it's a pretty nice little spot. Really safe. It's a blues. You can kill gnolls if you so desire. If there's a reason not to. Like, uh, they do have some pretty nice quests and stuff, ultimately. Good. Let it get him down. Hopefully. So, 
to do. So we're gonna combust the Shadow Guardian, get him to run as well. It's time to beat everything with a hammer for a second here. Which I'm really doing mostly because I want one hand blunt skill. But, uh, yeah, these drop the ice balls, which are used for some quests. I tried selling them in these commons, but nobody is really buying. But it's not like this is, um, I could see them actually selling a little bit more when the game, um, sorry, when Velius first came out. But, yeah. It's all good. I'm actually hitting this a pretty good bit, which surprises me. I think I just cursed myself. Yes, I did. <laughs> so, yeah, definitely advantages to this spot is they actually drop stuff you can sell at some point. I did not manage to sell my Cougar Call earring yet, but I have tried a couple of times. I've had people ask about it and then ask me if I would basically give it to them, and I told them, hell no. Somebody offered me like 25 platinum for it, and I was like, uh, no. A little bit better than that, sorry. At least in my opinion. Come on. Alright. I'm going to spare you all me not hitting this cougar. And pause for a second. And the cougar lies defeated at my... Now it is time to go... I think I feel safe enough getting another one. I'll try to find two Googers this time. For the sake of being able to use Panic Animal. I control the fight a little bit. There's one Cougar. Two bag of dicks. It knows I didn't med. Don't hit me, Cougar. Will not be friends if you claw me in the butthole. There's another. Range. There we go. Start pulling our cougars this way a little bit. It's a little bit safer in this little valley here. Should be pulling them too, but when they're snared, it takes. Oh, hello. I'm totally. Hitting the wrong button like that. Unfortunately. Go, go, Cougars. Stunned him. So that should fight pretty quick. Great. So I'm going to meditate up while they beat the piss out of each other, hopefully. Hopefully, keyword. As you can see, I've gained a pretty good bit of experience since I started out here. Um, I kind of had looked at this spot and then uh, a very lovely rogue invited me out here. We kind of duoed a bit in this spot and I was like, yeah, that would literally be perfect. To try. Right, man. Came back to... I really didn't feel like going back to split paw. But yeah. My cougar is getting the shit stomped out of it, so let's help him out a little bit. 36% cougar, what the hell? You are the worst cougar. Their thing. So cute, they're kind of wrapping up each other's butt there. Looks like that one fear is going to level the cougars out pretty well. Yeah, perfect. Maybe. Hey, my cougar is definitely getting its ass beat. Here again really quickly. My cougar is actually in danger. And Basically, I want to kill my cougar before shit's too late. Just gonna have you with a good old 
Crash and Combust. We're a mighty cougar, indeed. And we beat the shit out of you with a hammer for a minute. Sad face. Sorry, little cougar friend. Bust you again, maybe? Perhaps? Zero percent. Look at that. Damn, two dead cougars. Yeah, maybe we'll get lucky and actually loot something soon. See it. I see a body. Sad face. He caved on. Well, do. What a useless coup. I got a ton of um, pelts out here. Low quality cougar pelts, which are all for one quest, so they drop so common. Yeah. And eventually, I'm going to make my way to Eastern Waste and try to farm some walrus fat that I can then use to uh, get an item crafted for me that'll be a very significant upgrade. It's way better than my small patchwork sleeves, at least. But yeah, with that being said, I'm going to meditate for a moment and get back on the hunt. And it's time to go find me some more cougars. And while I'm doing that, feel free to go look for the like button for me. If you don't mind, help me out a little bit, smash that like button. I've already found a cougar, just like you've already found that like button. Second target. Fizzle. Snares landed. Closest cougar. Out. I hope. Force cougars and fight. Circles for a little bit here. There we go. Good kitties. Yeah, so speaking of other things, um, if you check the description of this video, I totally started putting some uh, Amazon affiliate links out there. Ooh, shit. Because apparently not happy with me talking about it. <laughs> Bad kitties. I think I'm going to charm the other one. It's fine. See, I had the meaner one. Anyways, I have some Amazon affiliate links up to the different stuff I use, uh, the wireless keypad I'm using to play uh, like Final Fantasy games, the keyboard mouse I'm using, um, so the headset I use. You can check those out. Um, I've been fortunate enough to be able to try all kinds of different things, so the ability to kind of check out all kinds of swag and get So here's your right here. Yeah. Totally foo bar this one, huh? I don't need that anymore. Alright, Shadow Guardian, that's not cool. My god, the fourth time. So we're losing arm on the scooter. Oh, you bastard. So, anyways, yeah, check out my sweet gaming gear. I love that, like, the second I decided to talk about that, like, the monetization gods were like, no. <laughs> Guess I just had them coming. Alright, so I got the cougar in. What I'm gonna do is let this cougar fight him. Yep. Pretty sure this, uh, monster is going to win. Definitely. So about uh, 10 or so. 
to 15%. Applied to mana. No mana. This one too pissed me off real bad. Let's move her down. Snare this trip. I could actually go charm another cougar, but let's end up with another mob to deal with. So I'm just gonna sing now. Bust. It'll be time for a nice little med break. Oh, oh look, he's still kicking. Well, anyways, yeah, that's just something I did to kind of, you know, I thought I'd share with the world the different stuff I use and. I'm one of those people that I'll buy a keyboard and not like it and return it and buy another keyboard and not like it and return it. So I was like, you know, I kind of do a lot of, uh, you know, definitely do a lot of uh, that type of thing. So you know, I try a lot of different swag and gear out as far as gaming stuff goes. So feel free to check that stuff out. In the meantime, it's time for a meditation break. So I'm going to pause, get full on mana. And hopefully finish off the floor. All right, folks, I'm back. There's some cougars somewhere behind me. There they are. Hello, cougars. Friend. Other new friend. Beautiful. We're having us a nice cougar. Jeez, maybe not. The second time, all of a sudden, these cougars are just like, no, we don't want to say try. I did not have these issues last time. Okay. Charm the other cougar because it was losing any. Kinda of works out. It's, it's definitely a meaner cougar. It must be a higher level one. That's why he broke charm so early. So these folks are waiting on bodies. Should probably so go up eight seconds. Cool. Cooper fight is very much skewed at this point. I think that other cougar is a little bit higher level and will even out soon. And we also the one drink. <laughs> oh look, it's this asshole again. I need to just stop fighting here, for real. There goes Charm again, hey. <laughs> okay. Oh, cougar one, fire in the hole. Fight that thing for a minute. Or not. Four points of damage. Damn cougar. Send him in there real quick. Check the body from goodies. Medium quality, I don't need. I'm pretty much just going to let that guy get hit pretty low there. And fire in the hole. Or hot fizzle in the hole. <laughs> yeah, ding. 35. So, I did not snare that shit. It's all good. It's going to hit me a couple times all the uh, time. So what I need to do actually with this. Uh, 
have that problem there, so we're just going to get close to the Tower of Frozen Shadow. It's near that creeper. We're going to head it this way. Eventually. I think I'll leave this creeper. Other one I need. Got me a cougar quality ring, right? Take that actually, that's also worth a couple hundred flat. Charm or cougar. Ended up this here Shadow Guardian pretty quick. Good deal. So we seem to have a much higher level cougar. I've beaten his ass a little bit. Problem. It could work. Somehow. Let's do. Yeah, look at that. Cougar is just. Only one more cougar to kill him. So we need some good. I mean, it's dead. I can root that from. Fight to the death. Cougar is what? What we do now is beat this dude with a hammer for a second. Actually, just for the sake of it. It's a lot easier and do that. As you can see, I am definitely in a hell level now. The XP bar does not remember how to move at all. I'm gonna beat this poor cougar to death. Hammer. For so wild. So, looking at tracking here, I can totally stay here for quite a while. All this stuff is still blue. I so desired I could sit here to level 36. I will more than likely go find a group somewhere though instead. Because how levels are a little bit better in a group setting where you're not watching the experience bar and not move basically. That's just kind of depressing and boring. Uh, but yeah, I may go find a split pod group perhaps. Or maybe I'll get spunky and go check out Miss Moore again. Who knows? We'll see. In the meantime, we're going to put this poor cougar out of his misery. Or perhaps the cougar is going to put me out of my misery. It's all good, friend. Just a few more whacks of this hammer. Okay, we're getting close. Cougar is basically dead at this point. Ah, come on. Please die. Please die. And the cougar is dead and a low quality cougar skin. I think you see actually all things considered, that did kind of pretty good bit of experience. Um I'm not sure if the 25% experience bonus from Memorial Day is still active. It's only been a couple of days and I don't know if they restarted the servers. But it's a possibility. So that being said, as promised, I'm going to meditate up a little bit and go check out this pirate outpost. But real quick, I decided to detour over to the Druid Rings totally on purpose. I'm going to point out for those of you coming in here, these dire wolves are also some options for you to kill. Plus the Darwolf Stalkers at Sea and Bids. And Frost Giant Scouts, and these all hang out right around the port in. So if you're a level 34 Druid and you decide to port in here, just be wary of the fact you can totally get murdered just for teleporting into the zone. So now I'm actually going to run back over to the Pirate Camp to visit those fellas. Just thought I would give a brief little warning about uh, the dangers of. Reporting into the zone, especially when you're like 
high level because you could teleport in and easily get overwhelmed by a pack of mean mobs. Should return shortly with our visit to the gnome place. And just another random thing. I assume this is where Lottie's all spawns because I've got a bunch of people just chilling here waiting on something. Or perhaps they enjoy the view, who knows. So I found the pirate outpost. It appears to be full of disgusting little creatures called gnomes. <laughs> and also noteworthy here is there are a lot of snow fugers running around this uh, dreadful place. And uh, once again, I think if you are not a druid or ranger, probably each of them, they are just dubious to me. Yeah, if you look on the map, this is good as location number two. Not by the first dock that you come in the old fashioned. Yeah, just be aware this is a thing, it's here. Um, the pirates are indifferent to you, and there's a pretty high probability you'll get attacked by cougars in this place. It's not safe. <laughs> yeah, that being said. Appreciate all the love and support as always. Thank you for watching. And I am probably going to head to South Carolina to make another video. And just kind of show some places that you can kill for EXP there as well. So be looking forward to that as well. With that being said, as always, have the rest of your day.